short story the paper menagerie by ken liu in this lesson ken liu mentions two major events one the great famine and two the cultural revolution the great famine the great famine occurred in china between 1958 and 1962 this famine was man made chairman mao zedong the autocratic leader of the chinese communist party was enthusiastic about increasing crop yields his subordinates afraid to disappoint him lied and inflated crop crop yield estimates as a result the amount of food taken from the chinese peasant farming communities for use in the cities were based on widely inflated estimates of crop yields and hence the peasants were left without enough to eat most local officials were too afraid to reveal that the peasants were starving because the government covered up the deaths the exact death by starvation count is not known but some estimates suggest that more than 30 million people died during the famine the next is the cultural revolution this occurred in china between 1966 and 1976 here chairman mao zedong inaugurated the cultural Revo revolution to remove lingering capitalist and bourgeois tendencies from communist china and during the subsequent purges people accused of bourgeois or capitalist tendencies were abused imprisoned and sometimes executed the paper menagerie is a short story that explores the biracial relationship between a mother and her son who is of mixed chinese and american heritage the story is told from the perspective of jack the son who recounts his childhood memories with his mother who was an immigrant from china he remembers how his mother would create origami animals each one infused with a magical life force that made them come to life and it played with him as jack grows up he begins to distance himself from his mother and her chinese heritage feeling embarrassed and resentful of her accent and her cultural customs jack starts to reject his attempts to connect with him and assimilates more into american culture years later after jack's mother has passed away he discovers a letter that she had written to him before she died in the letter she reveals that she had been able to bring the origami animals to life because of a special magic that came from her love for him she also tells him that she had been unable to fully express herself in english and that her origami animals were a way for her for her to communicate with him and show him her love the revelation of his mother's love and the sacrifice she made for him makes jack regret his previous behavior and he begins to appreciate and embrace his chinese heritage he folds a paper menagerie for himself and keeps it as a reminder of his mother's love and the importance of embracing his cultural identity in the end jack realizes that his mother's love transcended language and cultural barriers and that her origami animals were a, more than just paper creations they were manifestations of her love and the magic that only a mother's love can bring please remember the kinming festival which is the chinese festival for the dead thank you very much